How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. So today we got something a little bit special. It's some bonus content for the week. It's a massive compilation of some of the scariest YouTube videos we've ever seen. So sit back, relax and enjoy. Nothing says terrifying like finding out that something ghoulish could be lurking around your house. However, that's exactly what happened to one of our viewers, J2001MG. This image was caught on a Wild Game Nation trail camera that was set up to watch a chicken coop. However, it seems that it might have also captured something rather chilling. When the security footage was inspected, they discovered some sort of horrific face staring back at them. It almost seems to blend in perfectly with the mesh from the chicken coop with its dark hair and wide nose, and even looks as if it could be screaming in one of the photos. The viewer mentions that the chickens were up in their roost at the time, ruling them out of the equation. Plus, this picture had a date and timestamp that said May 12, 2020, yet it showed up in the March 23rd set of pictures. While any time a mysterious face-like shape shows up on camera, one automatically thinks it could be a case of pareidolia. However, given that there are chickens living inside the coop, in this instance, there is certainly reason for concern. So what do you think's been captured in this creepy trail camera photo? Could it really be some sort of ghoulish creature? Love to get your opinions on this one in the comments section below. Posted to the YouTube channel Express News, this video follows a team of paranormal investigators as they explore a haunted house. While many of these ghost hunting programs set off in search of the supernatural, few can report having broadcast paranormal events live on TV. This seems to be the case here as the group miraculously manages to capture what could potentially be genuine ghost footage. As the video begins, the group is seen making their way through a creepy old building. For the most part, they're subjected to standard hints of possible paranormal activity, braving the possibility of getting up and close and personal with a spirit, the group appears to refuse to leave until they're able to confirm contact with a supernatural being. By the end of the video, it seems apparent that at least one of the investigators has chosen to stay overnight, setting himself up in a bed in the eerie house. A spirit then appears to take this as a clear invitation to make its presence known. At the 26 minute mark, their equipment begins to beep. A few seconds later, the door begins to open and close all by itself. Somehow the man manages to calm his nerves and tries to get some more rest. As the man sleeps, his equipment begins to beep once more. Suddenly, something invisible appears to sit down on the bed alongside him. A clear indentation forms as the man is slowly awoken by the scary event. Watching the clip, it seems that this scenario would be very difficult to hoax as there doesn't appear to be anything visible pressing down on the corner of the bed. Could it be possible that these paranormal investigators have finally gotten the proof that they were searching for after all? And what's more, it was broadcast on live television for all to see. This scary video, titled My Sister, first appeared on Raider Dog's YouTube channel in May 2001. It shows a woman in a wedding dress slowly approaching the camera with a very disconcerting smile. The video cuts and the woman is now wearing different clothes. Again, she approaches the camera with the same bizarre grin. The woman changes outfits once more. This time she holds her stomach as if she's pregnant. As she approaches the camera, she reaches for her face and removes a mask. The video then cuts to the woman in a kitchen eating various foods. First a slice of cake, then a banana. All the while unsettling music can be heard playing in the background. She reaches for her face once again and begins stretching out her cheeks. 
The video then abruptly cuts, leaving the viewer wondering what on earth they've just watched. One of the strangest things about the video is that it was posted to a channel that almost exclusively releases gaming content. In 2017, YouTuber Nexpo released a video discussing his own theory about the My Sister video. He suggests that it might have been made in an attempt to lure subscribers to his gaming channel. However, the fact that there's so little information available about the video or its creator makes it seem even more unsettling. To watch the full My Sister video, there's a link in the description box below. Many people believe that animals are much more sensitive to spirits and other supernatural phenomena than humans are. Redditor Britain969 may have captured evidence of this on film when she decided to record a video of her adorable dog. The footage begins with the cute pup sitting on the floor looking straight into the camera. He isn't playing or doing much of anything. However, that changes a few seconds into the video. As the camera rolls, the dog suddenly flinches and steps abruptly to the side, almost as if someone had kicked or shoved him. The dog stares for a few seconds at the spot where the invisible kick originated, cowering away from the unseen attacker, with his head down and his tail between his legs, giving a wide berth to the area where the invisible attacker might have been. Viewers of the video on Reddit are truly perplexed. Many who are dog parents themselves state that the dog's reaction clearly indicates it's been kicked, poked or shoved, even though no one appears in the video. Although no one was able to come up with another reasonable explanation for the dog's behaviour, viewers have unanimously expressed their hope that any resident spirit will start being nicer to the innocent pooch. This eerie video was uploaded to Ghost Guy Go's YouTube channel on the 16th of September 2018. The footage, which is reportedly taken from a live feed captured during Hurricane Florence, appears to show a ghostly figure walking across a pier. Some have speculated that the figure might actually be the infamous Grey Man of Pawleys Island, a ghost that is often seen in the area just before a severe storm. Local legend says that the Grey Man is the ghost of a young man who died whilst travelling from Charleston in South Carolina to see his fiancée. As he approached the marshes near Pawleys Island, his horse became stuck in the quicksand like mud and he was unable to escape. However, no one is certain of the man's identity. Some think that it may even be Percival Pawley, the man who the island is named after. Others think it might even have been the famous pirate Blackbeard. Over the years, many locals have credited the Grey Man with saving their homes during severe storms. In 1989, Pawleys Island residents Jim and Clara Moore claimed to have seen the Grey Man just prior to Hurricane Hugo. The two said they saw a man on the beach, but when they waved at him, he disappeared. Their house was untouched by the storm even though their neighbours' houses were heavily damaged. Could this footage prove that the Grey Man of Pawleys Island actually exists? If so, was he attempting to warn locals of the impending danger of Hurricane Florence? Children's toys aren't usually that creepy, but there's something about realistic looking dolls that gives many people the creeps. If you weren't scared of dolls before, this video may be the start of a new phobia. In this video, we watch as the camera slowly pans over the faces of a series of Disney dolls. The footage is shadowy, suggesting that the person behind the camera filmed the sinister toys after closing time. As the camera focuses on a particular Beauty and the Beast doll, the doll's eyes seem to stare straight at the watchers on the other side of the camera. Then the doll's eyes suddenly blink closed, sending the camera person running from the room in terror. It isn't unusual for dolls to have eyes that open and close, but usually the doll needs to be tilted for the eyes to close. The doll in this video was never touched when its eyes began to move. No one seems to be able to explain the doll's terrifying movements, but this video is enough to give anyone a healthy fear of children's toys.
Our lips definitely aren't sealed about how confused we are about this weird piece of footage, shared by TikTok user Egg the Hamster in June of 2019. Most of us know TikTok as a platform where people share fun dances and quirky uploads. However, some pretty weird stuff does pop up on the platform from time to time. This is one of those times. The young woman in the clip is holding what appears to be an ordinary tube of pink lip gloss. However, what we actually see looks more like a beauty product from a science fiction film. What is it doing? I, what is this? The gloss on the applicator appears to defy gravity as the young woman in the video moves it around. What is it doing? I, what is this? If you slow the footage down, the gloss actually drips upward at one point. It's unclear if the video has been altered in any way. However, the girl demonstrating the anti-gravity effects of her lip gloss appears to be just as confused as the rest of us. The lip gloss seen in the video appears to be part of the high gloss collection, belonging to the Kylie Cosmetics line by Kylie Jenner. Some theories have suggested that the friction caused by rubbing the applicator in and out of the bottle may cause the strange effect somehow, as there are a number of videos showing similar outcomes. So what do you think's causing this lip gloss to defy gravity? Love to hear your thoughts on this strange video in the comments section below. What is it doing? I, what is this? This scary video comes from Escape Paranormal. It opens with a stereotypical warehouse scene. An empty hallway greets the viewer as they're led deeper and deeper into the warehouse. While you instantly get vibes that something eerie is about to happen, you're left wondering when exactly it'll occur. Almost every single corner taken in this video causes the viewer to jump. The intense build-up adds to the suspense as we follow the person filming through the warehouse. After walking through a small doorway, one of the final things we see towards the end of the video is a series of storage lockers that are painted white. Without any warning, the door on the right flings open. It's a violent burst of activity in an otherwise quiet storage room. The incident scares the security guard enough that they begin to sprint out of the area as quickly as they can. As many urban explorers are probably well aware, it's often the lead up to an unexpected event that proves to be the scariest part of any investigation. Was this security guard witness to paranormal activity? The answer is unclear. However, one thing's for sure, they'll certainly think twice before returning to this chilling location. This footage was captured by a man who had recently moved into a new house. He mounted a GoPro on a drone and decided to fly it around to explore the area. As it passes by some old ruins, the man spots a strange figure in the nearby trees. As the drone flies closer, you can see that the figure is actually a woman wearing a long white dress. She remains perfectly still as the camera approaches. The man believes that the ghostly figure might be La Llorona, the weeping woman. According to South American legend, a beautiful woman named Maria once married a rich nobleman. They eventually had twins, a boy and a girl. However, over time, the nobleman lost interest in his wife and left her. One day, Maria was out walking by a river with her children when she spotted her husband with a younger woman. In a rage, she picked up her children and threw them into the river, drowning them. Once she realized what she had done, she too leapt into the river. It's said that La Llorona now spends an eternity searching for her lost children. If you hear her cries, you should immediately run in the opposite direction, as it's believed that they can bring misfortune or even death. Posted by Reddit user Amatsumina, this picture is one of the creepiest ghost sightings yet. Captured by the poster's ex-girlfriend and sent to a group family chat, what should have been an innocent picture quickly caused the family to panic. As the ex-girlfriend, her husband and two children checked into a hotel in Malacca, Malaysia for a vacation, the family quickly became worried. One of the children became feverish. Using the hotel for respite in order to help the child regain his strength, 
the ex-girlfriend sent the photo to the family's group chat as proof they had arrived to the hotel safely. However, the family would soon become horrified as the ex-girlfriend's brother would go on to ask who the strange figure in the mirror was staring back at them. If you take a close look at the mirror to the left of shot, you can see a blackened face with piercing eyes staring back at the camera. The family was certain no one else was in the room when the photo was taken. Absolutely terrified, the family requested a new room. Strangely enough, the son would soon fully recover from his fever just the next day, once the family was safely out of the alleged spirit's reach. As the uploader explains in the comments section of this creepy photo's post, their culture has a strong belief in children being affected by the supernatural. Had the ex-girlfriend not sent the photo to her family and had the brother not caught the demonic figure staring out at them in the mirror, it's unclear as to whether or not the child would have made such a miraculous recovery. There's very little information available about this video. The footage, supposedly shot somewhere in Japan, shows two people feeding fish in a pond. The large fish are whipped into a frenzy by the free meal as each one attempts to thrash its way to the front of the queue. Suddenly, a hand reaches out of the pond. It's grey and shiny, similar to the fish's scales. The hand is only visible for a brief second before returning once again into the murky water. Since the footage first appeared, it has continued to baffle viewers. Some have suggested that it might be the hand of a scuba diver that is unable to surface from beneath the thrashing fish while others think it might belong to a ghost of someone who drowned in the pond. Who do you think the hand belongs to? Love to get your opinion on this strange piece of footage in the comments section below. Posted by Reddit user DefenderLoha, the story behind this ghost footage, or lack thereof, is full of twists and turns. Coming home late one night, a young woman named Kimberly goes to tell her father that she's made it home safely. However, before she's able to successfully approach her father, Kimberly hears a strange noise coming from inside the house. Because of this, she decides to do a quick sweep of her own home in order to ensure there's nothing wrong. However, as she reaches the top level of her home, the home security system goes off and provides the family with an alert. As shown in the first screenshot uploaded to accompany the story, the security app sent a message to the family displaying, warning, an intrusion has been detected. The family moves to a safe part of the home while Kimberly's dad explores the house, seeing nothing off except for the wide open garage. As he checks the home, the security company calls him, to which he responds that they're not in any immediate danger. However, this is before the footage from the motion-activated security cameras is sent to him in response to the odd activity. The footage in question has not been provided to accompany the tale, but for good reason. There's nothing visible except for an odd thumbnail. What sets this story apart from a potential home invasion is the odd paranormal effects surrounding the footage. The footage captured by the camera was supposedly completely pitch black. As explained in the post, there was quite literally nothing visible in the video. However, despite nothing showing up on the video, the video's thumbnail is prevailingly creepy. Depicting a young woman hunched over, dressed entirely different to Kimberly herself or anyone else within the home, the image is haunting enough on its own. However, when paired with the fact that it was scrubbed from the actual footage captured by the camera, the entire fiasco screams potential paranormal activity. The figure in the thumbnail looks to be bald, has a strange thin left arm, and appears to be walking with a limp. Some have even said the figure looks like they're wearing a hospital gown. In this case, the lack of footage is certainly mysterious, yet it leaves us having to trust the Reddit user and take their word that the footage came up black. However, the haunting image of the strange figure standing in the home is certainly chilling and for now will have to remain a mystery. Uploaded to YouTube by the channel True Horror Stories of Texas, 
This footage was allegedly originally captured by a Nazi photographer in Siberia in 1948. As though that fact alone wouldn't make any footage captured unsettling enough, this video is particularly unusual. The mysterious footage appears to capture an animal that can only be classified as the long extinct woolly mammoth. The size and shape of a large tusked elephant, the creature seems too obviously long-haired to be anything else. The timing is eerie, as at that point the animal had long been extinct, while technology had not yet evolved to the point of creating such an animal digitally. An extremely short clip, this footage is still unsettling nonetheless. Could this really be a woolly mammoth that has somehow managed to survive in the harsh wilderness of Siberia? This peculiar haunting was uploaded by GI Tri TV. The mysterious footage seems to have captured something truly bizarre. The video opens up with a rather messy workshop. There are various items strewn about the room without the camera focusing on anything in particular. There isn't a single sign of human activity within the entire warehouse. After a few seconds, something eerie and unexplainable occurs. Starting from the right side of the screen, there's a small white line about the width of a can making its way into view. It flows through the air in a long thin line before making its way out of the doorway to the left. It then curves almost like a snake or bullet train banking around a corner. It's translucent and at least 10 feet long. Just as soon as it arrives, the mysterious apparition leaves and nothing's left in its wake. Even more bizarre is the fact that certain parts of it are more solid than others. Could this indicate there are multiple ghosts travelling in a row, or perhaps their souls following each other and are connected in some way? This creepy video uploaded to Abbott Ung's YouTube channel in 2016 shows a group of teenagers exploring an abandoned asylum somewhere in Canada. As they make their way around the dilapidated building, they begin to hear loud cries coming from above. The group decides to head upstairs and investigate. As they reach the top floor, one of the boys clutches at his nose as if there's a horrible smell in the air. Suddenly, some sort of creature appears at the end of the hallway. It's crawling on all fours and has long shaggy hair. Just as it looks as though the beast is about to leap towards the boys, they run in the opposite direction. The creature's moans can still be heard echoing down the hallways as the boys make their escape. The video abruptly ends and the viewer is left wondering if the group managed to make it out of the asylum alive. What was the mysterious creature? Some have speculated that it may have been a monster, while others think it may have been one of the former inmates of the asylum, one that was accidentally left behind when the facility closed. Either way, I don't think these boys will be returning for another look anytime soon. Does this eerie video show the spirit of a dead boy comforting his mother at a wake? In this startling video, which was posted to Facebook in early 2016, you can see a white balloon float eerily across the room at a funeral. It moves from the coffin to the grieving mother in a strangely precise way. The crying mother, Joy Ganda Vibar Almares, takes the balloon as a sign from her son and begins to make a hugging motion. The white balloon continues to act strangely around the distressed mother. It floats up and down beside her as she appears to take comfort in the event. The family, who are attending the funeral of seven-year-old Treby, believe the balloon was his way of saying goodbye. The clip quickly went viral, racking up millions of views. Thousands of comments streamed in from viewers who believed that the balloon's movement was a sign from the deceased boy. Others, however, thought that wind and static caused the erratic movement. It's a touching video whatever way you look at it. If the balloon gave even just a brief moment of comfort to the grieving mother, then it doesn't really matter what caused it. I'll throw this one out to you. What do you think caused the balloon to move at this funeral? Leave your thoughts in the comment section below.
posted to Reddit by user Tomato Superman, a self-professed skeptic, this shocking ghost footage is unlike the two previous examples. Captured in an old pub, formerly a hotel, the security footage shows a ball of light travelling in a distinctive arc across the screen. Vivid and bright, the light travelling across the screen feels like much more than a speck of dust or a fluke of the lens. As it travels around the corner and up the stairs, the light seems to mimic perfectly the trajectory of someone walking along the staircase, as though the light that is visible partially represents the spirit present. Given the site's long and storied history, it's no wonder that staff and guests alike have all reported strange happenings around this old pub. Interestingly, this pub and Lemp Mansion were both at some point boarding houses and hotels. The connection between the two is worth a note. Perhaps the more people that pass through the halls of these old buildings, the higher the chance of getting lingering spirits in the afterlife. With the light's clear visibility and purposeful behaviour, this shocking footage has stumped both the uploader and viewers alike. Not all weird footage involves ghostly visits from other worlds or unexplained phenomena from the skies. The strangest videos of all are sometimes the ones that capture something from the natural world all around us. This piece of weird footage from Indonesia that was supposed to showcase some family-friendly entertainment went viral for all the wrong reasons. Twitter user at Patia shared some disturbing footage of a monkey on a motorbike attempting to snatch a toddler. The footage was also shared by a number of news outlets around the world. The monkey in the video speeds down a walkway on a tiny bike. It appears to be a happy scene until the monkey gets to a bench where a group of children are sitting. The monkey hops off the bike and lunges at a toddler without warning. The monkey then pulls the toddler down to the ground before attempting to drag it away with extreme strength. The stunned child is pulled along for a second before breaking free. The scene is both bizarre and disturbing. Fortunately, it's been reported that the toddler in the video is just fine. The monkey is apparently part of an entertainment group in Indonesia. However, this clearly isn't the type of entertainment its handlers were going for. Hey, 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 mas, mas, mas. hey. In another of LiveLeak's unsettling videos, amateur videographers claim to have captured footage providing evidence of a real-life spirit. This footage comes from a playground in Saudi Arabia. In the first clip, we see a close-up shot of a swing moving back and forth on its own. While some may believe that the videographer or an accomplice pushed the swing before starting to film, the way the swing moves proves this theory impossible. When a swing continues moving after it's been pushed, the movement usually gradually slows down until the swing comes to a stop. In this clip, the swing continues, moving at a steady pace from beginning to end. The chains holding the swing even twist slightly at various points, something that would be impossible without an outside force acting on the swing. A second video quiets naysayers who believe that an unseen accomplice must have been using a string to move the swing off camera. In the second clip, a passerby shoots the scene from their car several yards away from the playground. The video shows the entire area around the swing, proving that there were no additional accomplices moving the swing. Wind can also be ruled out as the other swings are perfectly still. In that case, what did cause the swing to move like this? Perhaps a playful ghost looking for one last go at a childish amusement. Making the list of some of the most mysterious footage on the internet is this disturbing clip, uploaded to YouTube by Lucas Firmino Successo 2019. What is evidently footage of a security guard touring the perimeter of his building at night, the footage begins in a relatively routine way. The building seems to be abandoned and empty, with everything seeming normal at this time of night. Touring the perimeter, everything seems to be occurring as usual. 
That is until the man focuses the camera on a nearby escalator. There, a strange figure is seen riding the escalator upwards. The guard appears to report the sighting before making chase. The footage goes blurry as the guard runs towards the figure. He looks up the escalator, but there's no one there. He then turns to see what appears to be a young girl running down a corridor. The guard yells and starts running. The footage then cuts out and we're left wondering what it is we've just seen. How is it that the young girl went up the escalator but seconds later was somehow on the ground floor again? Were there two intruders playing a prank on this unsuspecting guard? Or did we just witness the inexplicable movements of a ghost? Hailing from an unknown source comes a truly terrifying encounter with the spiritual world. While not all spirits are inherently evil, there are definitely those that appear to have malicious intentions. This woman has obviously had her fair share of ghost sightings. After lying down on her sparsely populated bed, the woman shares through captions added to the video after the encounter that she couldn't breathe and couldn't move. She attempted to call for help of some kind, but her tongue felt numb. It was impossible for her to speak any words or communicate in general. In the video, we see that she manages to make her way out of the bed, but it isn't long until a terrifying figure rears its ghostly visage. A figure cloaked entirely in black begins to lurch upwards and rotate outwards towards the girl. Everything but its face is shrouded in darkness. The face of the apparition is as pale as snow without facial expression. It almost stares at her with a sort of hatred. It doesn't make any noise nor any overly aggressive movements. Perhaps the most terrifying aspect of this ghastly being was the absolute control it had over the poor girl's physical body without even touching her. Have you ever encountered a sleep paralysis demon when trying to get some shut eye? Love to hear about your experiences in the comments section below. Uploaded to the YouTube channel Christian Bello Web, this clip originally appeared on an Argentinian TV channel based in the Entre Rios province. In the footage, a man and woman are seen broadcasting live on Instagram, likely due to social distancing protocols. However, it seems that the transition of many broadcast programs from inside the studio to inside the homes of TV personalities has not led to a decrease in paranormal activity caught on camera. In fact, this new trend of broadcasting from inside one's home might be an opportunity to capture even more creepy events. As the two speak to each other, the background of the man's home is seen to be illuminated by a lamp placed on a table behind him. Suddenly, the lamp flickers before appearing to be tipped over by some sort of unseen force. <laughs> Whether it's the sound of the lamp falling or the lack of background light that catches the man's attention is unclear. However, he appears to be understandably shocked and confused by what's just taken place. While it's possible that the lamp could have simply been pulled over by someone standing out of view of the camera, it seems unlikely that anyone would set up such a prank during an important live interview. <laughs> So what do you think? Was the lamp's bizarre movement the work of an inconsiderate trickster? Or could it have been manipulated by something supernatural? Love to get your thoughts on this one in the comments section below. This startling footage was filmed in the early 90s by Steve Lee. It's hard to track down the original, but this clip was uploaded to the YouTube channel Phenomenine in 2010. It appears to show a bizarre ghostly orb floating in front of a security camera. In 1991, couple Stephen and Beth Lee moved to what they thought was going to be their dream home in Black Forest, Colorado. 
Shortly after moving into the picturesque two-story log cabin home with their two young sons, some very strange events began to unfold. Just a few days after moving in, the two boys began noticing strange lights in their bedrooms, bizarre flashes and floating orbs. Soon, Mr. and Mrs. Lee also saw the phenomenon in their own master bedroom. In the weeks that followed, a paranormal storm of activity took place in their house. Rattling chains could be heard at night time, disembodied whispers and footsteps were a routine occurrence. Objects would often move on their own, furniture displaced, plates smashed in the kitchen. Orchestral music was heard filling the downstairs parlour one still evening. Strangest of all, a sharp chemical smell would often appear out of nowhere. So pungent was the odour that it would burn the eyes and nose of anyone nearby. Lee initially thought the strange happenings were the works of pranksters, intent on driving the family out of the quiet backwater town. He eventually installed state-of-the-art security systems to try and catch the vandals in the act. Lee's security cameras would go on to catch a plethora of strange phenomena, which convinced him that his house was haunted. This video here shows strange shapes floating through the air. Orbs of light streak through the night air, leaving a strange glowing effect in their wake. The most striking of all is the last object captured. It looks to be quite solid and moves in an erratic motion. Some viewers have noted that the object almost looks like a tropical fish superimposed over the top, with special effects to make it look eerie. The way it moves does indeed look like the motion of a fish. This has led some people to believe it's a hoax. Despite the critics, Lee became convinced that his house was infested with spirits. This photo was taken in one of the bedrooms of the Black Forest home. In the reflection of the mirror, you can see two eerie faces glaring back at the camera. They have sinister glowing eyes fixed in sunken black sockets. There's a menacing expression on their faces, yet at the same time they look distant and lifeless. This image has been analysed hundreds of times, yet over and over again, experts are left scratching their heads, unable to explain the photograph. So what do you think? Are the Lee family telling the truth? Is this log cabin deep in the Colorado wilderness truly haunted by something not of this world? Now, if you're enjoying our longer compilations, then check out that one on the top there. Otherwise, there's a massive paranormal playlist here you can binge on for hours and hours. Leave us a comment down below, pulverize that thumbs up button as usual. And that's it for me, I'll see you all next time.